A lot of what you just described has to do with, uh, you know, agritourism, tourism, and that interrelation between community, tourism, building cities and counties. So it sounds like when it comes to jobs that are in the hospitality industry, you will support that as well? Oh, yes. You see the relevance of it being into uh, yes. our areas. We probably have more restaurants have opened in Hattiesburg. You know, you probably yes. named something that I said we got. It. You know, Olive Garden. We had it. Definitely had it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, that was what people we said for years. We need an Olive Garden. We need it. So we actually went out and started trying to recruit an Olive Garden. And we got an Olive Garden. Because they looked at our demographics, they looked at where we are. You know, we are more of a. And it's, you know, any kind of restaurant. But what we need is to make sure that we, we, we incentivize these small businesses so if you got a mom and pop restaurant that they can expand, they can buy the equipment they need, they can do the advertising that they need. And those are things that we need to try and do. That's because that entrepreneurial spirit in the States, we kind of lost that. We become complacent with it. And we become complacent because it's so difficult to make it work. It's so difficult to make it happen, to get that support that you need, those resources that you need. And so we keep, keep trying, keep trying. You try and uh, uh, and that's what we want to do here is put people to work by asking them what is it that you want first of all what is it that you want in Mississippi that's why we're here here job. now what is it that you want you want jobs <coughs> we want jobs for you but you got there's some things you got to do in order to get the jobs and that's what we want to that's what we're going to be working on that's what we do in order to get the job but we're going to have to restructure some things like education we have to look at some of these businesses that are not paying taxes and find out why they're not paying taxes. Mm -hmm. And we have to take the money that are not paying taxes and put them somewhere so that we can incentivize other things like daycares and, and, and entrepreneurship and all those things. There's a different way of doing it. Um, some of the things some I'm not going to like. Uh, but I'm not in it to make people, I mean, for people to like. You know, uh, you know we, we in it to, to represent your views. And that's what we want to do.